last time on Who's Out of Order. Um, she's AK Keisha Chavez, AKA Yasmin Pin Davis, is a former singer, model, and TV personality. But her best known role has been wife of Joe Smith. <laughs> uh, that's it. <laughs> that, that, so this is what made mean. her, huh? <laughs> mm -hmm. So she wasn't like a superstar porn star. Oh, right. and it, 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 I'm trying to figure out. I think they're only back to like two dating for a few years, and they married in eighteen. So. I mean, whatever she assumed, because um, I'm looking at tied the knot in 2018 after dating for a few years. Hmm. So the way she, the way they appear is that they've been together for quite some time, but I guess it has not been that long. I mean, that's right. six years. I mean, that's uh, right. going on six years, we should say. Yeah. Um, and she made a little splash because she did the whole wedding dress thing on um one of the popular reality shows say yes to the dress so i guess oh. she got some not some notoriety with that okay okay and probably gave him a little too because he probably was out of the pocket for a lot of the other people after his 16 year career with the nba right so oh, so that's man. a little background on her that we were to pull real quick yeah um but and looks like nothing to write home about Right. So they must be really bad off that she feels that she can, you know, at 52 years old, go, go on back to that. Or yeah. it just shows you her mind state because, like, again, you know what you get most of the time. So you, this is what you went and picked up. Right. Right. And um, knowing all the, knowing everything there was to know about her, and you still chose her, which is, not a problem for me because you have the right to make those decisions about your life but then times get rough and she reverts back to but but maybe she revert differently because she doesn't when you're working for the industry there's there's a manager there's someone's controlling if you're a hooker you gotta you gotta pimp because she's taking full control with you know her only fans page so, yeah uh, yeah i mean that's all fine if if you're single but as a married woman i don't even have a problem with it as a married woman i think it's um if they collect that if her and her husband were in agreement and this is right the way to go forth right. then i would say yes yeah. so um the highly argued finding out what people are actually worth would still give mr joe smith worth about 25 million so wait a minute <laughs> he's still worth 25 million um that you know what um, let me keep reading there's data oh uh, nope that was it. okay so he was done playing in 2017 somewhere around uh i think so i'm not so he was sure. already a 25 million dollar man prior to marriage right so he had went through half of his earnings but then, so then, IR, then IRS would, would have taken half of the earnings on its own. Yeah. So those, this is probably loosely based on could, the, the income that they know that he was contracted at, which would be 61. You cut that about in half plus some, then we're, we're at the 25 million. So that's right. even before we get into his purchases and or investments or anything like that. Right. That would be that. Well, I heard he was a big spender. Okay. Um, a lot of cars um houses things like that even before he met her I, I, okay. I believe he was he was married previous to her and okay. um, that you know that didn't work out and everything but him actually getting with a porn star and marrying her and I I, I don't I don't know if I could do that. I mean, and I wouldn't personally. personally either, but I just believe people have the right to to fall where they fall. I mean, yeah. that's your choice. But you, because you know, we all reap what we sow. We hate it. You know, whatever we put in and what we put into, what ground we put, that's what's going to grow up. So I mean, mm -hmm. tried mm -hmm. to pull out, tried to make a queen, but he was in a whore field. 
<laughs> yeah, <laughs> right. Because she said, <laughs> she said, you knew what I was before. You know, let me let right, me get like, to that like part. She I'm owns on. it. She owns it. Yeah. Right. Right. And she said it like so with confidence. She said it with and, confidence, like you knew that. You know, the way she said it to me was like, you knew that if this wasn't going to work out, I'm going back. I mean, that's basically how how it came off to me. I'm going to let this play a little more, though. Cool beans. Go ahead. Listen, it's not fucked up. And we're going to. Okay, look, so. I have an OnlyFans page, and he's mad because he's just now finding out about it. Of course, a man can just find out about it. I'm not doing it. That's the part I don't like. Like, I could understand if he was down with it. That's fine. But to do it behind his back is so, like, evil to me. And to stand on like that. Oh, he's mad because he's just now finding out about it. You you look simple with that falling out of your mouth. Exactly. You know, like, of course he's mad to find out about that you're right. doing erotic videos or porn, whatever you're doing on OnlyFans, you know, giving, you know, cat shots or whatever you're doing. We don't know. Right, right. Um, it could be feet. Feet. <laughs> we don't know, but still. I mean, I think... <laughs> I doubt it, but yeah. <laughs> I'm just like, <laughs> <"Woo."> <laughs> oh man, yeah, I doubt it though. <laughs> but ah, that that right there, that I I think that part is the part that really triggered me, is because you're married and decisions like that, you should talk to your spouse about. You know, that's a whole career change, you know, and you haven't talked to your spouse about it at all. So that tells me that she's got one foot out the door and ready to go. That's how she's acting because he's mad about it. You know, in the beginning, I saw her smiling a little bit. She's just like, yeah, yeah, whatever. The smirk was kind of, yeah, she's she's checked out of this. This, this has not been the five years she thought it would be. Right, right. It's, it's probably not even close to what she thought it would be, you know. All right, I'm gonna let it play a little more. Cool. Yeah, with anybody but myself. So why should I have to tell you my choice, my body, my body, my fucking choice? Your partner's supposed to come to me and talk. To Joe, me. I've been talking to you about mad things. I've been asking for solutions to shit. You're not giving me none, so I've created one. That's no solution, not in my book. You knew, you knew who the fuck I was when you met me. Before. Uh, you knew who the fuck I was before you met me. Yeah, you knew, Joe. You knew. <laughs> and, and you knew that this, this was a possibility that she could revert back to her old ways. Now, he probably thought that he could take care of that and pull her out of there captain save a hoe or whatever you thought you you were doing but as soon as you started failing in her eyes she went back to what she knew i and mean part of that trust factor i believe is that they both have missed the mark i mean yes he yes she believes she found her prince charming yeah he believed he cleaned up his you know white princess Mm -hmm. You know, and they both failed in that illusion of what relationship was. But I think one thing that he still tried to do was based on what we're, this little window we're seeing into is like, but we're still a team. Like he, see that team aesthetic has been snatched out of there, and that's what kills it. So you've yeah. been doing this. You you've created income that you feel that works. However, you haven't shared it. So where's mm. so there's multiple levels. Yes. To trust yes. So if this income is so strong and so it's treating you yeah. well, I as your spouse, if we're in the same income and our our finances are merged, I should know that this income is coming and where it's coming from. You know, yeah. not stumble yeah. over it. Howsoever, he found out it's like 
Um, and that, and that's and what why is it taken I said, care of? Because yeah. it, I should be aware. Like the conversation is very singular on her part, right? You know, and, and that's why. Pushing, and right that's right. why I say that she already has one foot out the door, because you know it's not like she's bringing in the money and saying, "Look, I'm bringing in the money for us. I, I'm doing this until you can get back on your feet." I'm doing no. She's not saying any of that. She's just like, look, you knew what I was before. This is what I'm gonna do. And obviously, I don't know how long she's been doing it. Um, and he didn't know about it. But obviously, um, either he's really, really bad with with finances, and she's been helping out with the bills and stuff like that. And he didn't notice because I think I would notice if. If if my wife all of a sudden got money that we didn't have before, I right. think I would notice that, you know, so it's, she's either hiding that money or she was putting it into the household and he just didn't notice it. Or it just depends on how it comes in, you know, um, your money could be your money, but you're not satisfying my wants not not that the needs i mean for all we know and i don't want to i don't know enough about him to be great where he's at financially mm -hmm. you know even though she is to some degree but are you not getting the things some things that you want because we might be needed i mean the house should be paid for right. you know it's like we we cool over here we, looks we may like not a nice house we may not be lebron <laughs> but we're good over right here. but you want so much more which would I would understand from just her bio. I mean, you're a former actress that we don't know, former <laughs> singer that we don't know, <laughs> former porn star that we don't know, probably getting the most um, notoriety right now of your life based right. off of this clip that you <laughs> taped of you and your husband having this exchange when you tell him that you are the owner of your body. When once we commit to be one we are co-shares exactly. of each other but you've already made a strong proclamation that this is your body and do what you want to do so you i'm not what's my power word i'm not considered <laughs> right 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 you know so yes we need this money consider how that it, this affects our celebrity because mm -hmm. this affects our celebrity now you may make a little money for the next couple of weeks, so people want to be nosy. But then after that, you've just lost your allure. Yeah, it's over. You at know, that people point. want to come in to see this 52 year old woman and be like, oh, so you got to make some change because people are just going to pay whatever they need to pay to see you for a quick second. Right. You know, so you're going to get your monthly subscription or your one time view. I don't know how you do it. Um, you're going to get that, but they're not coming back, honey. Hit the like button, subscribe, and stay tuned for part three.